Okay class, in the previous lesson, we tried to identify different theories behind the formation of a rift valley. Uh, but this time let us concentrate on each and try to explain deeply. Let's look at tensional forces theory. As we said, tensional forces are forces which pull away from each other towards opposite directions. So how do these ones lead to the formation of a rift valley? Definitely these forces, when they pull away on both sides of the crustal block, the crustal block will be subjected to stress. And what happens, it will crack. And when it cracks, the lines of weaknesses are formed. And this makes the crustal block between the two lines of weaknesses uh, become loose and stable and it sinks and finally a rift valley is formed. Let us uh, this is step number one. This crustal block is subjected to these tensional forces pulling away from each other and the lines of weakness, the cracks, the fault lines are formed on both sides. And this means that the central block, this central block will be and it will sink and leaves a depression which is called the rift valley. Thank you.